come back to Woking? How does it feel to get your future sorted? Yeah, no, it's good. Obviously, um, spoke to the manager about two weeks ago, and you know, he come across really, really well and, and positive. And you know, he's been looking at me for quite a while, even when I was at QPR, and um, it just seemed right. You know, it's just a good club. Um, was here before, and yeah, no, it's just good to obviously come back and you know, hopefully get a good season under my belt. Um, and get playing, yeah. You obviously mentioned you were here before, back in 2018. Yeah. Um, what was it about this place that made you want to come back? Um, you know, when I was here the first time, you know, the fans were great and, you know, it's, it's a good club and it's not far from where I live. So, ideally, it's um, it's, it's good for me to, you know, come back here and play. And and especially, the main thing was obviously the gaffer um, who sort of swayed me to come here just because, you know, he's a, he's a good coach and a good manager and I think he'll get the best out of me. Yeah, you're quite. We know you're quite a high energy, sort of physical player. Yeah. Um, how would you say your game's developed in the last four years? Um, I've obviously, you know, I've, I've matured as a, as a player, and I've become a man now since the last time I was here. And you know, I think you know I've got more experience in, in league football and, and things like that. So I've definitely matured as a player, and you know, hopefully I can show that next season. Yeah, going back to earlier in your career, you obviously played against Rian Norris and, and uh, Jamie Vardy against yeah. Leicester. Um, yeah. Did you think at that time that they were going to go on and win the league the next season? <laughs> well, the, funny enough, the, the game, you know, when we played them, we, we lost 5-1. That was the last game of the season and, um, you know, they looked very strong then. So I wouldn't have thought they would have gone on to win the season um, the following year. But, you know, they looked very strong and, you know, they looked unified as a, as a team. So, um, yeah, very good. And where does uh, scoring a hat-trick for your country rank amongst your personal achievements? Yeah, it's, um, you know, it felt great. Um, you know, I've played for the Republic of Ireland um, at under-17s, under-19s, under-21 level and to do score a hat-trick at under-21 level is, you know, a massive achievement for me and, um, you know, it was a good experience there because you get to, you know, play against other countries, other styles of play and I think that that's so, yeah, I've gained a lot of experience playing for my country. Yeah, and you're one of a number of new faces that are joining the club. How yeah. exciting is it to be part of a process like this? Um, yeah, it's, 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 it's great. You know, the gaffer is known who he wants to bring in. And, you know, we, we spoke uh, earlier on today and the players he's brought in, you know, are experienced and, you know, you know, very quick players and very exciting players. So, no, I'm really glad to, to be a part of it and hopefully we can do something next season. Well, welcome back and uh, look forward to seeing you at the start of the season. Cheers, appreciate it.